Final Gambit, hello? Okay, okay. Um, it's the Squawkabilly! Guys, we found it! We found the world's strongest Pokemon player! They're here! They're real! That's insane. Uh, do I even need Tailwind here? I think I have to go Tailwind. I, I really want to go with Mr. Fingers, and honestly, I can probably do both. I think I always lead off like this. And I think I bring Mr. Fingers in the back, because the fake out could be really heat. And I honestly don't see a, too much of a use for Golden Go. My first game uh, of the day, I haven't played much in a few weeks. Uh, you wreck me, I'm going to go back to watch the VOD and try to learn. Okay. Reveling Wanderer, just know. I judged you heavy on the plays. I judged you heavy on the plays, but you can learn from it. And also, I'm doing kind of bad today. So, like, I, I understand. Just so you know. Okay. Look, alright, so you know how, like, I... You know how, like, there have been multiple games tonight where there was a Golden Go in front of me, and I said there is no chance that they don't Terra Ghost here? You know how I've done that multiple times tonight? I'm... Or they don't Terra Steel? I, I, I don't want to risk it again. I really don't. I can't be burned this way again. Alright, let's just go for the Moonblast. They might be Sash. I swear, if they didn't Terra Steel, if they did not Terra Steel again. Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, like, this is this would be the third game in a row where we saw a Golden Go. The third Golden Go game in a row where we saw it and it didn't It didn't even Terra Steel. It did it didn't even I get granted it got rid of the weakness, right? And now my matchup's kinda bad. Now my matchup's like awful actually. Like I don't I don't beat the I don't beat Terrifying Golden Go. Oh no, this isn't a policeman's hat. This isn't a policeman's hat. This is um It's a train conductor. Okay, good news is I can save this. Because for some reason they shadow balled. Let's get in Great Tusk and Taunt. Maybe. Actually, I think I'd go Grimmsnarl. Eh, I think I'd go Great Tusk. Grimmsnarl. Great Tusk. Grimmsnarl. Great Tusk. Grimmsnarl. Okay. I can bring this back. But it's gonna be- it's gonna be an uphill battle. It's gonna be an uphill battle. I absolutely, positively, have to hit him with the Yoinky Splinky. Brave Bird. And I think I fake tears here. Actually, I think I Spirit Break, because I should outspeed right now. I, yeah, I think I Spirit Break for damage. With Tailwind, I'm fairly certain I can outspeed a Golden Go. I just need to get it in range of um, Terra Fairy Dazzling Gleam. Alright, it's not Cloak. Make it rain. Countflame should live that. Grimstar is going to go down. I'm pretty sure I get Spored here. But as long as Tusk gets in, I think I'm fine. There's a Spore. I like have to tear a fairy D gleam, don't I? I hate this. I hate this game. Um, yeah, that's the only way I can get away with this. There's no way it lives, right? I can lock Moonblast, but that's like way too much of a commitment. 
Or I can lock Shadow Ball, but that's like too much of a commitment. I think I have to Brave Bird. Or no, I taunt. My bad. Why am I thinking? Why am I thinking? I shouldn't be thinking. We learned that. We learned our lesson. They rage powdered. Okay, I think we can win now because of that. This should KO. Nice. Alright. Uh, I have a chance to wake up. And it mostly just comes down to getting rid of stuff. <laughs> getting rid of stuff. And I think my best win con is trying to KO the... Squawk ability, which is probably Focus Sash, looking at the team. So I should just double attack it. Because if they get a Tailwind off, I can lose. Talonflame, please wake up or I will I will hit you in the face. I believe in you, Mr. Talonflame. I don't know about that one. Depends on the set. Final Gambit, hello? Okay, um, is that the end of the world? Not quite. Not quite. If Townflame wakes up, I think I'm fine. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Oh. <laughs> okay, how do I beat this? I'm adamant. That's the main issue here. That's the main issue here. I'm adamant. They might protect the Amoongus, but they could also protect Great Tusk. I think under every situation, my play is to double Great Tusk, though. And, like, Earthquake. I could also double Amoongus, and that might perform about the same. I can also Will-O-Wisp. I think they're just gonna redirect anyways. Let's just do this. Talonflame! Why are you lacking? Why are you lacking? Okay, Talonflame survives. We still have a chance. That did like nothing to the dude. It did nothing to the dude. Oh my god, why did that do nothing? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. My best play, unfortunately, is Will-O-Wisp Great Tusk. Because I don't knock out the- I don't- I don't knock it out with, um... Yeah, I think they're just gonna, like, spore me an attack. Yeah, okay, if I get this burn off, that's huge. Come on. Just get the burn and I can win. Get the burn. Come on. I'll cry. Okay, <laughs> threaten to cry and the game will give you what you want. I, I, I think I win now. I'll cry. <laughs> That's the threat you have to make. Alright. Luckily, Great Tusk has, like, beefy boy physical defense, so I think I just barely win now, barring a crit. I don't want a headlong rush, that's too risky. Yeah, that's that beefy boy. That's the beefy boy. You're going for the palm puff. I just keep earthquaking, that's literally my win con. I think that I can KO. I'm adamant. I think this KOs. Come on. Come on. KO and we win. KO and we win. Okay. That should be game. I don't even think a crit will, like, KO me now. 
So my next play is going to be Protect, and then I, like, Headlong Rush. And we established that I'm slower, so Headlong Rush into Protect will, like, always KO. I could also, like, Earthquake, but, like, I'm risking, like, a lot of crits there. Actually, is the damage difference even that big? I don't think so. I think I just Earthquake to be safe. And, like, spam Protect. Yeah, because even a crit won't do it. Cash catch him. Thanks for the resub. That's a full year, dude. Thank you so much. Yeah, and now Protect just wins. That's a full year. Nice. Okay. Oh, that was really stressful, dude. That was like a crazy stressful endgame. All right. What's our what's our rank after all that? Callum was so EP. It was so EP, bro. He was so EP, bro. So EP. All right. Let me see my rank update. All right, that's not that bad. Look, now now I'm no longer concerned about having like a super super low rank. But also, I need to make sure that I hit... I need to make sure I hit an hour and a half of streaming tonight. So there's eight minutes left. Do I do one more battle? I'll do one more battle. Hopefully it's not like a super long one. I started stream a few minutes late today. Ooh, do I go with old reliable though? All right, take a vote. Take a vote. Which one in chat? Hyper offense or hyper defense? Not really hyper defense. It's just garganical. It's it's just jarganical. No way I'm using rental teams again. All right. So let me let me read chat. Um. Defense, defense, hyper offense, defense, offense. I only see two offense, so we're gonna play. We're gonna play defensive mode. We're gonna go insano mode. No more unga bunga for tonight. We're just gonna we're gonna play like an alternative unga bunga, where we're more like slowly regaining our health by eating bugs from under a rock, like cavemen. Well, I guess cavemen hunted with spears. Oh, that's another mouse hold. Um, how bad is this matchup? It's not that bad. Not that bad. As a matter of fact, like, my dude goes kind of crazy here. Also, Terra Ghost can just really mess him up. Let's lead off like this. Let's be extremely annoying. All right, no, cavemen didn't hunt with spears. Rock, okay? Cavemen hunt with rock. Watch this be the Night Slash Gallade again. Honestly, it might be. It might be the uh, the anti-jarganical Gallade. The anti-jarganical Gallade. Any tips on how to build around Stone Jenner? Actually, a Stone Jenner top cut Orlando Regionals, go just, like, copy that team and, like, make your adjustments to it. Um, I believe it was Wackapuff's team. Oh. Well, this lead just kind of goes hard. This lead does just kind of go hard. I'm going to Salt Cure uh, Mousehold because it's the most annoying. And I'm going to Protect her. If they have Super Fang, which a lot of them do, um, next turn I'll just Terra Ghost to prevent any further Super Fangs. Bro, it's okay. I'm not going for damage anyways. I'm going for, like, chip. Consistent, annoying, frustrating chip. The type of chip that'll, that'll, that'll make you want to have nachos. I don't know.
All right, check this out. I'm gonna salt cure whatever switches in for the mouse hold. There's no way they're staying in. I'm gonna get in Mr. Hands on their taunt. Oh, they stayed in. Okay, that's fine. Hopefully they just taunt my Amoogus again. Incredible. Absolutely phenomenal. Incredible. Absolutely phenomenal. Another salt cure, sir. Another salt cure, sir. Okay, now check this one out. <laughs> now check this one out. <laughs> check this one out. Check this one out. Don't care. Does nothing. All right, now here's where they're gonna encore me. Here's where they're gonna encore me. So I don't even predict them. I don't even predict them. Or I don't even like predict the switch. I just go for the salt cure into the Grim Snarl now. And get in my, and get in my, uh, my Arcanine to reduce damage as much as possible. Or actually, I think I go Amoongus here technically. Cause I just, that's the least amount of damage. They're gonna encore me. I guarantee you they're about to encore thinking that they're crazy. You're not crazy, I'm crazy. Congratulations. What even is their endgame here? Are they just gonna bring in their own Garganical? Because I do have a plan for that. Oh, it's Gallade. Hello, Mr. Gallade. Uh, I'm going to Salt Cure and... Let's get in our, our Arcanine here. Hyper offense team ladder. It's the last. It's the last battle of the stream. So I switched to like an extremely defensive core. Like we're not using the hyper offense team anymore. Oh, that's actually quite concerning. That's actually quite concerning, in fact. Is that Choice Banded? If it's Choice Banded, I don't have anything to fear. Because Sacred Sword doesn't ignore your own drops. It ignores the opponent's drops. So I'm going to protect here. And go hard into uh, Iron Hands. Yeah, that's got to be like choice ban if they're switching out on this. Okay, I know how I get around this. Skelly Skellington Dirge, yes. Alright, I do have fake out pressure here. I'm gonna go right into Arcanine. And uh fake out into Mr. Grim. Get another intimidate off. Unless they're like fake tears, I'm fine. A torch song into my arc.
Grim flinches. All right, I have to make kind of a crazy play, but I'm not really, I don't, I don't really think it's worth it. Go for the Snarl. And I'm gonna Volt Switch on the Skeledurge. Actually, I think I Volt Switch on the Grim Snarl, just to like try to get a KO. And assuming it's Choice Band on the, uh, Assuming it's like a choice band on the um whatever his name is. Delayed. That's gonna influence like my, my Terra a ton. Oh yeah, I guess fake tears doesn't matter. Oh, that's really bad actually. That's like really, really bad. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Um I really need that Snarl. I can Terra Water and Spore and try to Snarl again. They might Terra Grass, but I think it's still worth it. And since they didn't Terra here, um, I can only assume I just got it off. Here's the Reflect. Moongus always lives that because he's crazy. Definitely got my Spore off too, which means I can just spam Snarl now. As a matter of fact, I think our I think Grimmsnarl might go down this turn, so I can try to burn the Gallade coming in. No, not quite. Okay. Um, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go for another Snarl and go for a Spore on the Grimmsnarl. In case Gallade wants to switch in here and he wants to save Grimmsnarl for like a later fake out or Thunder Wave. They want to go for the Thunder Wave now. Alright, so like I said, assuming it's Choice Band on the Arcanine, or on the, on the Arcanine, on the, on the, uh, Delayed, I should always be able to burn it here, barring any kind of, like, paralysis. And that'll help out a lot for the end game. What are they at with this guy now? They're only at plus one. I can still stop the snowball. Let me rage powder here. Hopefully I don't get full parrot on either of my mons. That being said, the likelihood is pretty high now. Bro's just got every slashing move, dude. But I think if I burn here, I just win. I wake up. Shadow Ball's gonna do a decent amount. Oh. Okay. This is gonna be close. Please burn. Okay. Might be able to save it. Can be really close. Light screen wears off. I do have hands here, so I can go for fake out again. Let me think if I snarl here, I, I like need to KO Gallade. Oh, 
Watch him be Terra Ghost. Alright. Don't get full parried. Don't get full parried. Shadow Ball. Just barely hang on. Nice. Okay. Gonna get another one of these off. I think I might lose. It's going to be really close, man. I, like, have to KO Gallade here. That's the only issue, and I think I dropped the Leaf Blade. Unless Iron Hands is just insane. Okay, hear me out. Wait, why do I protect on my... Hold on, let me check something. Do I protect on my freaking Iron Hands? No, I don't. I was like, why do I protect on that? <laughs> um... Maybe a second Intimidate could save me, but I dropped like Shadow Ball. All right, let's try. Let's try the crazy play. Maybe that'll save it. We're doing the crazy play. Oh, they're not choice banned. Maybe I live? Oh, there's slack off? Uh, there's a shot now. No, 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 no. There's a shot. There's a shot. Because I'm... Oh, wait. No, I can totally win now. I can totally win. Because I got fake out pressure. Oh, wait. No. I just realized I lost my Garganical. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I get, I get Garganical back in. Idiot. <laughs> no. No, I lose the Skeleturge. I don't know why, like, my brain didn't process that, that Garganical just went down. Alright. This is my only out, as if they just absolutely throw. That goes down. That's game. All right, that's fine. We stood up pretty good. We, we stood up pretty good tonight. Like at the beginning when we weren't playing Unga Bunga, we were doing kind of bad. But now we're doing now we're doing good. All right. So that's gonna be it for tonight's stream. We did hit the the time that I need to hit.